Ma'am, today I'm going to question you about Talavre wetlands. Mm. So first, uh, before we begin about it, can you tell me about the importance of wetlands? Uh, Sali, wetlands are the first level of defense for any city and especially for, uh, you know, island city like Navi Mumbai and Mumbai, uh, they are of prime importance. So they are the first line of action, first line of defense against the sea, the vast ocean, okay, jo high tide, low tide, tidal waves, storms, uh, tsunamis, all this, you know. So they are the basic front line of, uh, you know, blocking all this action uh, from the main city. And then the second aspect is they are very great natural filtration systems for our city. Jo salt water hai ocean ka. Uh, you know, ingress on a sweet, uh, sweet under underground aquifers mein, uh, bachata hai mangroves and wetlands. So it is like a sponge system which not only filtrates uh, the sewage or the you know wastewater that we are leaving from our city. It literally filtrates those you know uh, waters or lakes. Mein jo pani nikal hai, it literally filters filters that out and it also uh, it keeps the salt water at bay from mixing with the you know sweet water of our city uh, then they are the nurseries they are basically the nurseries of uh, aquatic animals of migratory birds native species of birds reptilian species butterflies insects you name it so mangroves are uh, they are literally the lungs of our city and uh, without mangroves uh, any biological system will fail, literally collapse. Okay? Okay. Ma'am, Navi Mumbai is now being called the Flamingo City. What is your take on it? Vaise the original uh, Flamingo City is definitely Ahmedabad and uh, Sweetco uh, wants to identify itself as a, as a Flamingo City. Uh, I have no objections in that because uh, they really attract a vast amount of uh, migratory birds, uh, lesser flamingos, la uh, la larger flamingos, lesser flamingos, definitely. But since 2018, there has been a steady decline in sighting of these creatures, of these migratory bird species, you know. So I think uh, they should first consider conserving the ecology uh, of the wetlands, of the surrounding uh, wetlands that uh, NMMC CITCO has in its jurisdictions and then maybe this would be a good move to have uh, because the, the nature of the problem that CITCO is facing is so land grabbing major because you know uh, land real estate has become a very prime uh, thing nowadays and uh, wetlands are targeted for encroachments for real estate developments and there are a lot of construction debris dumping hoti hai, you know, as a result of that also. Uh, uh, sometimes they want to destroy the mangroves so that they, claim, they can claim the land as a, a non-forest land. This is a strategy. And sometimes uh, it is uh, uh, you know, basically unconsciously by builders. Hi hoti hai. Uh, debris dumping. उससे क्या हो जाता है कि uh, अंडे जो होते हैं या जो uh, breeding grounds होते हैं वो दब जाते हैं uh, debris के अंदर and uh, ये जो uh, you know sponge जैसी ज़मीन है mangroves की the porous soil that we are having is turned into a hard landscape which is of no use to anybody because it cannot perform its natural functions. Uh, mangrove species कम हो जाती है ऐसे ही सब एरियाज में से मैंग्रोव्स व्हेन मैंग्रोव्स आर डिसअपीयर उसके साथ साथ ट्रेडिशनल ऑक्यूपेशंस डिसअपीयर होते हैं जैसे कि ट्रेडिशनल ऑक्यूपेशंस ऑफ फिशिंग जो मैंग्रोव्स होते हैं दे आर ब्रीडिंग स्मॉल नर्सरीज ऑफ क्रैब्स एंड फिशेस होते हैं एंड देन ट्रेडिशनल मेडिसिंस आर एक्सट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम देम तो बायोडायवर्सिटी ऑफ इवन मैंग्रोव्स हैव रियली फॉलन पहले यू नो नाउ ओनली अराउंड 10 स्पीशीज ऑफ मैंग्रोव्स आर फाउंड ऑल ओवर द कोस्टलाइन ऑफ महाराष्ट्र व्हेन देयर वर 50 60 स्पीशीज ओरिजिनली नेटिव स्पीशीज हुआ करती थी so they have collapsed. Mang mangrove biodiversity itself has collapsed. So you can see that biodiversity of native birds has collapsed. Behind it, uh, flamingos' ki biodiversity, fir, uh, so reptilian species, snakes, butterflies, insects. Uh, so uh, like uh, biodiversity has uh, a lot of impact on all these things. And every region, every mangrove has a very special ecosystem which is hampered. So these flamingo breeding grounds are first conserved and then give it a flamingo city. Thank you.